Hello there, Codemaker4 here. A while ago, I made a video titled Let's Revolutionize Logic. And well, let's say logic has been revolutionized, but in a somewhat unexpected way. I mean, I saw it coming, but not when I made that video. This is a new mod in Scrap Mechanic. It's called uh, MTEX Fast Logic. So this is a logic, uh, vanilla logic uh, utility mod um, made by people from the MTEX community. It's based on uh, Vince Ling's uh, mod, uh, but most of the code is original. And there's many more features. Here's Tensor Connect, which is a really advanced way to make lots of connections in interesting patterns very quickly. Um, and it's great. So I'm going to like quickly show you some of the highlights of the mod. So I mean, look, first of all, there's this great uh, settings GUI. Scrap mechanic modding is so awful that this is literally the easiest way to make a GUI. So this is a working progress version of the SMC4, a new computer that I'm working on. And as you can see, it's pretty large. Um, this has to do with the amount of memory it has. Um, and the amount of memory it has is not really what makes the computer cool. I really want to talk about this, but it's not quite finished yet. So it's enough to wait. But as you can see, my computer is running at like 30 FPS right now. Um, going full blast, and that's not because I'm recording. It doesn't get much better when I'm not recording. It's probably CPU limited somewhere. Scrap mechanic is pretty awful. So, um, first of all, the mod obviously has like a fast logic uh, version, right? So you can convert entire creations to fast logic. There's a bit of a lag spike, um, and then you can like do like tick stepping or speeding up logic, slowing down logic. Uh, which is great for being able to debug a creation. So uh, converting to fast logic slightly decreases performance, unfortunately. But if you want to go perfor for performance, then having individual blocks, especially if they're like modded to do Lua script, it's not going to be performant, no matter what you do. So another feature of the mod is called Silicon. Uh, Silicon basically merges multiple logic gates into one uh, single scripted block. And because of this, it can do a lot of optimized calculations, which helps with performance. So right now we got about 30 FPS. Um, but if we convert a large chunk of the memory to silicon, we suddenly get like 70, 90 FPS, uh, which is like two to three times better, which is great like just for free okay it's not quite for free because some of the connection tools don't really work um with silicon so this is mostly uh for the stuff that you're already finished with and not really developing anymore for me that would be the memory um so for performance it's great let's see what are other tools that i forgot there's like automatic placing stuff um lots of connection utilities um so Basically, lots of stuff that you used to need different mods for is all now in one mod. So a bit of transparency is that this wasn't 100% controversy free. Um, of course, this is all really inspired by the Vince Lake's Logic Tools and Parts mod. Um, when development for this mod started, it was all original source code. However, some stuff for the GY. Um, and some stuff for converting creations from vanilla logic to fast logic. That code has been copied from Vinsling. Um, Vinsling didn't think that was nice, but in the end uh, was okay with it because Vinsling wanted to open source the mod anyway at some point. Um, because Vinsling also knew that he wasn't going to develop the mod himself anymore. Um, so just a bit of transparency over there. On to the next subject. The SMLC has been renamed to the Scrap Mechanic Logic Community. Um, so instead of, so the focus is going to be moving away from standardization and more into um, just building a general logic community with tutorials, um, guides, and like a, a place where people can help, uh, ask for help, and show stuff they created. Um, and in there, there's currently a bit of a discussion going on, uh, arguing that logic that the scrap mechanic logic community is dead because it's not beginner friendly. So if you want to 
uh, join, come over here. Some of the stuff will still say Scarborough Mechanical Logic Consortium. We're still doing renovations inside of here. Um, so come and join. Links are in the description. I'm on holidays, so I won't be very active myself. Shout out to Nick now, Cubic, and Itchy Track, who are going to be taking care of the Scrabbing and Logic community and my own Discord server, which also has a link in the description. Um, they're going to take care of the server while I'm gone. Anyways, I'm good, Maker 4. Uh, I wish you have a great day. I still don't have an outro yet. I already asked you to join my Discord server. So, um, see you after the holidays, I guess. Bye.